IIT Madras day by day it is coming up with new new things like uh, recently we have seen that IIT Madras have launched a new course BSc Medical Engineering that is a new initiative of IIT Madras coming into coming into medical field for a common people uh, IIT Madras have also started BSc Data Science and now we see that IIT Madras is coming with the new courses. Let's get to know what is it. Uh, sir, uh, Professor Andrew, can you please tell me what is it new course you're coming up with? The new course is a BS, Bachelor of Science in Electronic Systems. That is the new uh, course uh, that we have introduced. It's in the exciting area of electronics, electronic devices, electronic system design products that are out there. It's all around us and we hope graduates of this program uh, get employed in that industry. What is the eligibility criteria? So the basic eligibility is you should have passed 12th standard uh, with mathematics and physics as two subjects. That is the basic eligibility for everybody. There is no other eligibility other than that. You can just apply. There is a qualification process that you have to go through. Once you qualify, then you are in. What That's is the qualifying? All. Basic qualification, there are two ways of qualifying. One is there is a JE route for qualification. If you if you qualify for JE advanced exam, you don't have to get any rank there. You should pass JE mains and qualify for JE advanced. Then you are directly admitted into the program. Or you can do our own qualifiers. You register with us and study for four weeks, write one exam. And if you get more than 50 marks, you qualify for the, for the program. If I am not wrong, is it similar to BSc Data Science? Yes. The pro basic process of admission and qualification is exactly similar to Data Science except for the 12th standard Maths and Physics requirement. In Data Science, we don't even have that. In this program, we need Maths and Science, Maths and Physics in 12th standard. There are people who have done already a diploma from some other university or there are people who are already studying some other courses but they want to take part in that like BSc Data Science. So what is uh, the, you know, uh, what is the uh, plans for those? Uh, so, so maybe Professor Bobby George uh, can yeah. answer that. So actually in India, the electronics industry is growing very fast and there is a lot of demand for skilled, you know, uh, industry, people with industry ready skills. So this, at the moment, there are very few courses, you know, that enable the students to reach that level. So this program is specifically designed, taking into account experts' opinion from the industry and so on. The curriculum is designed in a way that they will have industry-ready skills. So job opportunity-wise, we are very confident. Uh, at the moment, the curriculum is same for all, whether they have done diploma already or not. Because this is, a, as I mentioned, it's a specially designed curriculum to meet these requirements. So they will have their own benefit in the sense they will be able to do well or study well easily. Uh, otherwise, there is no uh, special, uh, you know, they cannot, for example, join in the second year. They will have to start from the beginning. But as I mentioned, it will be relatively easy for them. Now with this course, you are uh, actually aiming to make it a manufacturing hub so that it can generate more jobs. Yes. So how this course is going to help for the youngsters? Okay, one of the things that is happening is a geopolitical thing. A lot of industry, particularly electronics industry, is moving out of some countries, coming into India. So that is happening in a pretty big way right now. And uh, that, will, that is going to increase. So one of our clear bets for the next 5 to 10 years is a lot of these big electronic manufacturing companies will set up in India. So if they set up in India, they are going to look for quality people to hire. So job opportunities in this area will only increase. Any electronics manufacturer, any electronic uh, designer, any electronic uh, service guy, all those companies can hire from this program. So we are covering everything. Just because I said something about service industry, we are also happy to have these people work in the service industry. There's no problem. So our program is also designed to cater to that. So we are catering to all the possible job opportunities that are out there. Could you please explain what is the fee structure for this course, whether it is diploma, a degree or certificate course, what is the fee structure and what all the scholarship you are offering. Specifically, if I talk about, you know, the girl child, you know, girl student. So, first of all, uh, the, the fee structure is as follows. So, uh, we have, there are three tiers, right? So, there are multiple exit options. You have a foundation certificate, you have a diploma uh, possibility and a four-year BS degree. So, uh, the for the foundation level certificate, uh, you will have to pay uh, about uh, 80,000 rupees to, that's about 11 courses or so. Uh, that will take a little bit, maybe a year or maybe a little bit more than a year. 
for the, the diploma covers about an additional 11 uh, courses or so. So that will cost about uh, 2.5 lakhs. And the full four-year BS degree will cost about 5.8 lakhs. And we do offer scholarships based on Government of India guidelines, as well as there are also other opportunities such as merit come means scholarships. When did you start the first batch and how many students took part in that? So the, the first batch is starting now. So it is starting, so the application deadline is 25th of June, 2023. And the first batch is, will be starting, uh, you know, uh, immediately after that. So the qualifiers will happen for them. Uh, in July and August, but September will be the first term when they start studying the full term. So like BSc Data Science, this is a new course targeting to the, uh, you know, uh, India making a manufacturing hub upcoming, you know, in coming years. There are a lot of more companies who want to uh, have a, their footprint here in India. For them, there will be a skilled, uh, uh, skilled persons who can actually be fit for these kind of job. IIT Madras is stepping into new field. With the camera person Vincent Ritesh Ranjan, DD News Chennai.